shall regret those words. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews. In this episode, we take a look at yet another game coming to the long journey that has been the Sega Genesis and Mega Drive with Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Before we start, I would like to thank everyone who has subscribed to my channel and hope you enjoy my content I provide. I'm trying to hit that plateau of 1,000 subs, so please like and subscribe if you like what I do. The game was originally released way back in 1997 to Sony's original PlayStation and then to the Sega Saturn a little bit later and with the invention of Xbox Arcade and downloadable content, the game was pretty much ported everywhere else. No one expected such a feat to an ancient machine like the Sega Genesis and the Mega Drive, but here we are. With game dev and YouTuber Pigsy, who has been trying to port the game for a while now, the dev unleashed a Christmas 2023 demo of the game and honestly it is very very much playable. Released on Christmas Day of 2023, this demo of Symphony of the Night is easily emulated or played on original hardware. For me, it was easier to emulate since I don't have a Genesis cart ever drive, so my Retroid Pocket 3 will have to do the heavy lifting. There are two versions of the game that you can choose from. One has more enemies, but may crash the game at times, and I did many times before moving on to the more stable version, where I witnessed no bugs, but much less enemies on screen. I'm sure this will all be worked out soon, as this is a proof to concept demo. I'm still surprised that the game is even working on this level. The animation of Alucard is a sight to behold. The character's movements are so smooth in motion, it brought back memories where the Genesis shine for all others in 2D with their absolute flawless animation for their time with likes of Aladdin, Mickey Mania, and Flashback, and so many countless others. Although the voice acting is great for the Genesis, this is where the hardware reminds you of those old garbled sad times. The soundtrack did surprise me as the renditions are pretty well done. Nothing beats the original symphonic sound from the CD quality tracks, but this is still very impressive coming out of the good old Yamaha chip. The game is hard, or I just got much worse at 2D gaming. I died multiple times, but I guess that is the point where it teaches you to refrain and think before you just go on and attack. Overall, what a splendid showing of what these devs can do with such old hardware, still pushing expectations higher and higher. Glad to see the old Sega Genesis and Mega Drive still showing life with yet another unexpected but awesome port of a game that shouldn't even be. That's it for this look at an incredible proof of concept demo of Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and great. Take us out of here and I will see you all next upload. Damn.